Hey guys, Toffee here. Welcome to my channel. We're just going to be doing a video on this uh, Trackstar 150 amp ESC and how to yeah, waterproof it and anything else for that matter. Uh, the tools you're going to need, uh, pretty standard stuff, whatever it takes to take your ESC apart, generally a flip screwdriver and maybe an Allen key of some sort, and then you need the products you're going to use to clean it and waterproof it. We're going to go ahead and use a CRC product, ElectroClean, to clean the PCB and all the electronics. This stuff's really potent. Don't get it near plastic because it will melt it. I found that out the hard way. <laughs> Moving on, we have uh, the product that we're going to use to waterproof it, and that's HPA Conformal. This stuff's lethal. Make sure that you have a lot of uh, ventilation in your area, otherwise you will get very, very high, basically, and it's not a good high. So make sure you have lots of ventilation, otherwise this product's fairly simple to use. All right, start taking it apart. This track star is pretty simple. It's just four screws on top, and then the casing comes apart. I was kind of hoping this is a used ESC. Um, I was kind of hoping it was going to be a straightforward, quick, quick clean and a quick spray, but it didn't quite turn out to be that in this case, which is normally what happens. Right, looking in there, it doesn't look too good. Full of sand and all sorts of other junk. So this is going to need a bit more of a clean. Going to have to wash all the plastics and do a thorough clean on these boards to make sure that we get a good waterproof. Make sure to uh, obviously store away all your nuts, bolts, screws, washers, whatever it might be. You don't lose those. Uh, remember where they came from though. Um, you don't have to do this, uh, but I, I did because of how dirty it was and I wanted to resolder the connections. So I'm taking off all of the um, soldered connections um, so I can do a full clean and waterproof and then I'll resolder everything back on. Um, again, you don't have to do this. This has been a bit anal. There you go. All separated, now ready to be uh, washed down with some ElectroClean. You'll see how dirty this uh, the ElectroClean gets on that plate. Again, don't use a plastic plate like that because it will melt. Just heads up. <laughs> you just start seeing the uh, the runoff of the ElectroClean. Look at the colour already. It's already uh, pretty nasty. This stuff really does clean so well. I was blown away at the difference. I thought the PCBs were clean in the first place, but when I washed them, wow. So whilst you're doing this, just take mental note of where you're going to want to mask off that you don't want to get the conformal product. Um, so you want to mask off areas um, such as heat sinks or heat transfers and any electrical connectors. If you can form all those, uh, electricity or heat won't get through them. So, so here I'm just masking off the uh, heat transfer pads that go onto the heat sink. Because I don't want corn formal getting on those. But I want it all on the board and everywhere else. So it can be quite tricky, but uh, this is where all the prep work counts. And you see there on the two boards that you've um, I've masked off all the pins. The heat transfer pads as well. I would also mask off the, the posts where the cables go for the motor and the power. And this stuff's pretty straightforward to use. You just spray it on. Try and do varying angles and, and distances. I went quite close and quite thick. Definitely different angles so you can get under under connections and, and you know sort of try and spread the product around. You can move the board around to, to move the liquid around. It does go on quite damn thick. Once you've done one side, let it tack off, turn it over and do the other. And you'll end up with a product like this. It's, something that's, uh, it's got a nice shiny coating on it. And you, it is a UV trace product, so you can shine out with UV and see, uh, see where you've hit. Once you're happy with it, put it back together and away you go. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later. 